goddess of war and wisdom. Does it please you, I wonder, to watch your city on the verge of battle? You've returned. Did you bring the proof I asked for? I think this might interest you. I took it from the commander after I killed him. You know what it's about? What do you mean? Your reaction betrayed you. Yes. The man mentioned in this note was on important business for Athens. Why was the messenger trying to get to Mytilene? She was to help distribute supplies to the people there. To help them against their oppressors. Who is this man to you? You look concerned. He was only an aide. It was his mission that was important. I hope this proves I can be trusted to get the job done. Proved you're competent, yes. Trusted? You did read the note. I had to make sure it was proof of what I did. It could have been anything. A good point. And because of this, I have another task for you. I need you to find my messenger, Yerimos. This was the messenger from the note. Yes, it's imperative Yerimos is freed and reaches the ship I've read it for him. What mission is your messenger on? The fewer people who know, the better. But understand, it is vital to the future of Athens. Tell me about this messenger of yours. He's of no significance, but his mission is. Find him so he can complete it. Where is the ship I need to take him to? For now, it's safer you don't know. Once you find him, he will tell you. Where should I look for Yerimos? If the Spartans have him, he'll be in the old quarry. I have it on good authority they're holding all their prisoners there. Don't worry. I'll get this Yerimos of yours to the ship. Thank you. 
This area will be well defended. How many boats? Good. You made it. I was beginning to worry. I told you I'd get you out of Athens. So you did. Can your friend be trusted? Theras and I have been friends for a long time. I just sent word telling him where to meet us. Wasting time will only get us into trouble. Let's head to Serifos while we still can. Here we go! Hey, we go, no, no, no. 
of that alive. Something to be thankful for. have to do that. Do what? Fill the silence. Oh, I wasn't trying to do that at all. I simply don't find myself traveling the seas very often. It can be freeing. Yes, freeing seems to be an accurate word. Although I've begun to feel a bit sick. Lean over the side if you need to. Otherwise, you're cleaning it up. Is your stomach turning as much as mine is? You'll get used to it. We'll reach Seripos before long.
waiting for you, Commander. There's much to do, and many unknowns. Faster! Then try to grab us! Fast as we can! Commander, close the time press! Sails up! That! More than us! Let's move! Ugh! <laughs> 
I'll see you all at the selection ceremony, ladies. I especially hope you show up. Let me guess. He's rich. That's Etios, the scion of the most influential family in Chaos. And his wife choosing ceremony is tomorrow. <sighs> we need Eros' blessings to be picked. You hope to marry into riches? No! My feelings are for Etios, not his wealth. Even if your feelings for him are real, they get stronger with Rakmi. No! I really am in love with him. You better start praying like the rest of them. <laughs> no, I have to stand out. If I do what everyone else is doing, I'll never be picked by Eros or Etios. I need to do something. Anything. Anything. Yes. Anything. <laughs> Eros? Please, his ears are stuffed full with the prattling of these women. Let me help. I'm a witch of Ekati, goddess of witchcraft and magic. I know just the thing. A love potion. Ridiculous. Love potions are a myth. I'll buy it from you, please. Sell it to me, and don't let the others hear you. I don't need your drachmi. I spread the word of Ekati freely, but a love potion is tailored to the imbiber. I have to make one just for you. And once you've drained every last drop of it down your pretty throat, you will exude pure, irresistible beauty. Aetios will fall in love with you instantly. First, we'll need two things. A cask of the finest wine, and some wild mushrooms. Uh, but where can I find that at such short notice? I'm sure the Mystios could procure these items for you. Please, Mystios. Please, you've got to help me. In the name of love, and a lot of Drachmi. Well, I'll give you all I've got. If Etios picks me, I'll be sure to give you even more. <sighs> Fine. I'll get the ingredients for your love potion. That's all. I'll see to the items. Excellent. Meet us at the temple on the hilltop when you're done. That's the shipwreck with the wine. Hope the pirates haven't gotten here yet. New day in Greece. That must be the shipwreck she was talking about.
This is all the wine left. The looters stripped the shipwreck clean. Well, come at me! That's the warehouse. The wild mushrooms will be in there somewhere. Damn! Get out! Out! Must not burn through! Shit! Ah, shit! Out! Out! Customs warehouse. Better get looking for those mushrooms. Ah! Uh. 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 
Wine and wild mushrooms. That's all of it. I should go to the girl and the witch at the temple. Ugh. <sighs> 
I see you. Here's everything you asked for. <gasps> Thank you, Mistios. Now I just need a more personal artifact. The last ingredient. I've come this far. I'll see it through. What else do you need, witch? No, no. What I need, the girl can provide. I'll give you whatever you need to be with Etios. We'll just need a little snip of your beautiful locks. Your part in this is done, Mistios. Come to the selection ceremony at Aetios' house to witness the fruits of your labor. It's the one overlooking the sea. You've got to come! Once Etios picks me, I'll make sure to pay you your due. I hope he has deep pockets. His love didn't come cheap. Come. There's much left to do. See you at the ceremony, Mistios. Sorry, my love. Give me a moment. Some peasants need my attention. You said a little bit of her hair. Explain this. <laughs> Explain? It's clear, beautiful, gullible, idiot girl falls prey to her competition. She set me up! Etios picked her instead! He, he didn't even take a second look at me. What happened to the potion? Why, she drank it. And look, it worked wonderfully. <laughs> she added a lock of my hair to the potion and then made me drink it. I didn't feel anything strange at the time, but when I did, all my hair, it just began to fall off. What trickery is this? 
You used her hair in a spell? A spell? Are you idiots? If only something so convenient existed. It's simple alchemy. With a little knowledge of poisonous local flora, anything is possible. And wild mushrooms are known to cause violent reactions. But honestly, I've never seen anyone go bald. Just a horrible rush at best. This went better than I expected. <laughs> Why would you do such a thing? Aetios can be no one's but mine. I'm the one who truly loves him. I grew up with him. I've always been the one looking out for him. You think I'd let some starry-eyed fledgling after his wealth steal the love of my life from me? Aetios doesn't know what's good for him. He's been eyeing this one for a while now. He liked the way she looked. So I changed that. <laughs> I was promised to rock me. Just give it to me. I didn't sign up for any of this drama. Technically, the girl asked you for the items, not me. She's making fools of us both! Kill her, Mystios! You're crazy. You'll pay for this. She played the game and she lost. There's nothing to pay for. You believe she's innocent in all this? She tried to get ahead with magic, so spare me the hypocrisy. Just leave and take your bald friend with you. Please, Mistyos, do something! I'll cut through every last one of your guards to get to you. Guards! Stop this, Mistyos! Why won't you fall? Yeah! What have you done to my wife? Hey, for this Mistyos. What's a little girl doing in a clay pit? Oh, Mistios. Hi, Mistios. I'm just preparing something for my friends. I've been here all day, but I still need more clay. I need enough for all of them. What you're doing for your friends is very nice. I'm sure they'll appreciate it. Really? You think so? I was thinking of getting them some other things, though. You're a generous friend. What do you want to give them? I want to give them some nice jewelry. <laughs> you mean jewelry? That's what I said! You don't look like you can afford any. Honestly. I know. That's why I was going to get some shiny stones in the abandoned mines. And a few pearls from the lagoon. But I've been stuck here all day with the clay. And the abandoned mines are kind of scary. Do you think you could help me get some gifts for my friends? It'd make them happy and that would make me happy. I'll make some gooey for you too, for helping me. Gladly, young lady. I'll see to it you get the best pearls and shiny stones. And I wouldn't mind some gooey myself. Yay! Thank you. You're really nice for a big scary looking person. 
Okay, that's all I need to know. I'll see you later. I should be done here soon. Meet me at the cliff overlooking the lagoon, okay? I'll introduce you to my friends. Thanks, Mithios. That's the lagoon with the pearls. This is the lagoon the little girl mentioned. That's enough pearls. Ah, the mines. That's where the shiny stones are.
The abandoned mines with the shiny stones. 